So I just want to do a little meditation, a little venting, I don't know. I don't know what it's called, but I want to do something to kind of get my blood pressure level down. Let me just say that today, working at one job was very, 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 very hectic. You know, and for being on one and a half hours of sleep, I, I'm shocked that I made it throughout the morning without blowing up more than what I could have. Not that I blew up today, but I was very, very, very close. In fact, now that I'm on my two-hour break before I go to the next hellhole, I decided to get one of these. A four-pack. As a little something to calm me down. You know, some people need cigarettes, some people need pot, some people need punching bags. Well, this simple little wine cooler is my little calming down thing. It's light, it's good, just a little something to kind of, you know, ease my mind off of the hard day of today. You know, I just don't understand people who really honestly act like their shit doesn't smell. Um, people who look down on people who's serving them. Um, you know, I just don't understand. I don't understand the rudeness. I don't understand the thinking you're better than somebody. I, I really don't. Um, I don't think people realize how much restaurant workers go through on a daily basis. And especially those people who haven't worked in such atmospheres. Um, they are just so, I mean, on a constant basis, you have, you're constantly repeating yourself, you're constantly dealing with people's bullshit, you know, people snatching shit from you, people getting upset because you can't hear something, you know, because maybe not speaking loud enough, or people who get upset over a simple thing such as a straw, you know, I, I just, I don't understand, I, I don't understand it. You, I don't think people know the impact, the mental impact that their stupidity has on restaurant workers. I, I, I don't understand. You know, but it makes me feel good to know that I, out of all these years, worked hard to get what I have. And that is my masterpiece outside, my fabulous Elantra, and, you know, I, I worked hard to get that. I've dealt with people's bullshit for many, many, many years to get that instead of having it, having it handed down to me, you know, by people who think that they're all snobbish. I don't know if it's just a Colorado thing or what, but people here in Colorado suck. Flat out, they suck. I, I just had to say that. So I just wanted to just vent a little bit. There's a lot more venting I would like to do, but I guess that's more like me talking to myself off camera while I enjoy my little seagram. But I just thought I'd come on and share a little information. Anyway, you guys, I hope you're enjoying your week and enjoying your day. And for those people out there who think that your shit doesn't stink, I think you need to think again on that. Anyway, you guys, thank you for tuning in, and as always, holla back.